So what's happening? So these are checkpoint for ISIS. And he doesn't have one. Stop telling everyone. <laughs> Uh, so let's see how this goes. Get my girlie up for today. Yes. We are not leaving. Five minutes. I want to go to the next one. I want to go yeah, I want to go to the house. 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 I time because we've been uh, driving around doing shopping for the <laughs> birthday tomorrow so we've been really busy uh, we've got a lot of stacks at the, at the back a lot of meats and stuff like that and uh, drinks of, of course the taxi because we're in Samoa so we don't really get that um, in Israel but right now we are having some uh, mince and cheese pie from uh, Farmer Joe's Brown Bakery uh, by Kiri Fo uh, by Kili. yeah we're gonna have some of these I've had the donuts so unfortunately I won't be able to uh, do a review on that but I'll give this one a bite and see how it goes okay Mm. Mm -hmm. That was a big bite. It's a big one. That's pretty good. It's pretty creamy. Uh, it's pretty different. I will because we're from the Neiden, right? We're staying in the Neiden, and the pies in the Neiden, majority of the time, they're always black. They're really dark, but this one is light. Yeah, as you can see, it's like golden brown, right? Just like myself. But, I... <laughs> but yeah, we'll give another bite, mate. <laughs> Do you think yeah, see, she's covered in chocolate, mate. We had some twist um, donuts, and man, those were fire. But um, we came to the markets yesterday, to the flea market over at Formal We had some kikipotas there and stuff like that. I tell you, mate, kikipotas were they hit different. The bun itself wasn't oily, the meat was nice and juicy and fresh. Um, we're, uh, we're gonna be driving to Kua soon and we'll show you guys some some clips of uh, our way to Kua and how beautiful um, just just being able, just being here in Samoa is a beauty man but uh, yeah thanks for coming through um, stay tuned and we'll see what the others are up to onwards to Kua let's go hey guys we are here at the lookout we just wanted to catch this view Look at this view though! Damn! That's beautiful! Let's go! Let's, go here. Let's follow Danita! Show us the view Danita! That's beautiful! Good time. <laughs> Nona, let's go. Everyone's on the good bus heading to Kua. Um, chill. Like, not super excited, but chill, relaxed. Whoa, that's a shot right there, son. Bam. Bam. Okay. 
few words of the trip so far. How's the trip to Gua? Bit tired. That's all right. Rest in the car. Rest in the van. When we get to Salitoma, what are you gonna do? Ah, oh, <laughs> sweet. That's the one. That's the one. Oh man. Anyways, can't get enough. This view is so beautiful. Chicken later. Let's go, baby. First two on rounds to go. Like a little detour. Yeah. Oh, Charlotte, I didn't see them, mate. Uh, welcome back. Uh, we are making our way to Kua now. As you can see, it's the beautiful Samoa, mate, the ocean, the water, mate, and all the natural, natural beauty of Samoa. You know, trees everywhere, a lot of greens, right? It's a beauty. I ain't gonna lie, mate, the, tra uh, the traffic is not bad, but the drivers, uh, different story. We won't even touch that topic, mate. It's just neck level, mate. Or the man the kipi or the car through the other car, mate, normal. Ah, uh, there's no speed limit, no idea. It's either someone's going so slow or going too fast for the speed, okay? But uh, the road, it's pretty good. I think we are in uh, Lauli. Lauli is known for... Um... <laughs> it's beautiful, but they're quite known for uh, throwing rocks around. <laughs> nah, just a joke, mate. Anyways, uh, back to where we're at. We're still at Lauli. As you can see, there's mountains all over the place. They call that... I think this, we're still in Mount Vaya, the man himself. If you're not sure who he, who he is, he was a giant back in the days um, and he fell asleep and he's still sleeping to this day. And, but you know when you sleep too long things start growing on you, like the hair and um, people's uh, problems. Five of us boys, we're gonna be crashing here. Oh, look, his and hers, oh, his and his seats. <laughs> it's just the boys' seats. Nah, it fits well, it fits well. Shower, yeah, it's nice, it's spacious. I think there's one off the back as well, if you're going to look at it. Oh, we even got a very near dryer. Oh, yeah. Look a little bit. Now we're gonna go check out the, the girls' room. Let's go. Yeah. So we're gonna go to the girls' bungalow now. So we booked one for the boys and one for the girls. The boys' one is the one we just viewed. And then the girls one is a little bit more expensive just because it's by the seaside. So they get a nice view. Oh, that's nice. Damn. Okay. That's nice.
Same setup. I mean, I don't really mind. Where it's the same setup. All right, who wants to sleep with me? <laughs> Hey guys, so this is the view from the girls. It's so close to where they are. Literally like 10 seconds walk. And then you get to this beautiful view here. And they even get this, what do you call this? Like a wharf or something? Yep. I don't know. Should we go walk it? That's See, that's all good. Look at the beach. Cheers. Oh my God. Man. And we paid like 500 tala uh, for the night so it's like 300 bucks new zealand for five people in one bungalow Five for the view. Uh, so good. All right, tune in later. We'll see what we get up to. That about. I'm setting up for um, Salad Bama Sands because this is where we're going to be, um, be at with the Scarfy Coconuts. So they're just setting it up. This is one of the rooms, the aircon is on, it's got the fan and whatnot. So it's, it's a straight beat. Joe's already uh, making this sound comfortable at home. Um, so this is what the place looked like. It's got, I think it's got seven bedrooms. There's another bedroom as well. So this is going to be uh, where me and Sue's going to be at. Um, I think um, our engaged um, buddies, um, the friends Benu and um, Drew are going to be in this room. So yeah, they're gonna be in this room. Um, the, the room over here, I think, is this is gonna be for the single ones. Sorry, sorry, Naja, Missy, and uh, Sarge, just kidding, mate. Here's another room here. It doesn't have a fan, but so this is room number four. That's room number three. Over here, there's a bit of a kitchen area there. And room number five here with another aircon as well. But there's also like the doors to walk out and uh, enjoy a bit of uh, a morning cup of tea. And so that's room number five, and this is room number six. It hasn't been set up yet, but there's a slightly smaller one. And come on over. We're still going. Um, so this is the bathroom. Bathroom area. See, pretty cool. Something like on the sands, mate. Something like on the sands, mate. Make sure. Um, 
Not the bathroom area back here. I think this is for, it's gonna be for the, the ladies or for the lads, I'm not quite sure. Um, but yeah, so over here is like the kitchen area. It hasn't been used in a while, as you can see. Um, more over to this side as well. Um, and then everyone else is just sitting up. It's like the lounge area over here. Pretty cool, right? Um, yeah, so I think we're using one, two, three, four, five, six. So six bedrooms. The other one's just going to be used as storage. Um, but yeah, shout out to uh, uh, to Mambuka and um, Ako and Sulu for uh, setting up the place. Um, can't wait for everyone to, to come around and witness here. But mate, the best thing about it, mate, as you can see, it's like the beautiful water out there, mate. The beach, mate, the sands and all not. Um, also the coconut trees. See? What a beauty, mate. So I'm going to walk you guys through the front area. So yeah, um, we are at the front now. So we call this uh, it's, um, the veranda or the Fapaoluma. So it's like more of a space to like enjoy. But uh, yeah, it's a cool, cool place to be at. Um, it hasn't been used. So pretty much my, my partner, um, so, um, this is where her childhood was at. She grew up here before um, they moved up to the mountains now. Um, uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool spot, eh? There's a funny side more there, another one over there. But yeah, so far we are enjoying it. What, what does um, GF stand for? Tell them what you thought. So in the menu it says GF, so if you buy food, you get a free girlfriend as well. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, see. Stop waiting, man. You can't. You're looking free. Huh? You're looking free. But even there, my trees are quite pricey. Yeah. Oh, it's lost. I mean, not pricey. Say it with the chest. I can afford it. Yeah. Shut up, guys. Yo. Ready? Yep. So many uh, feathers going on, but. Oh, Where photos? It's a video. Oh, no, nah, this is a photo. Wait. We're at the um, Salitunga Spine Resort. Um, we booked in for dinner at 6.30. Um, and we're just waiting for our table and a couple of our friends. We're just looking through the menu. Um, we'll show you the menu soon. Currently, 6.57. We'll show you the menu soon. Um, prices are like, mm, not bad. Like, we went to Sao Messina and they're like a little bit pricier. They have the, the food at Sao Messina is really good, so we'll wait and see what the food is like here. The beers or the beverages, we've got a bit of a run around with our happy hour, <laughs> being told different times. Um, and it's like 28 tala eh, for like a cocktail yeah. and stuff, which is expensive because if you go to Sao Messina, they're like 15 tala, mm, so kitsch. they're expensive as. Must be because it's so far from town, so there's no other places you can resort to. Maybe either that or they just bump their prices knowing that the clientele that they True. get is the rich, you know. Yeah. But for us who's here for the day, who just wants to enjoy ourselves, it's a bit of a... So we're just going light on the busies tonight. Probably go heavy tonight. Mm. Go heavy on, on the duty free. Yes, sir. Emphasis on the word free. Um, but yeah. Oh yeah, I actually went to the bar and got a cocktail. I think it just depends on the person. Table set up. Okay. Let's go. Let's get to the table. Okay, right now we're in some Tonga, up in the mountains. Um, today I want to show you guys how to husk a coconut. But before we do that, I'm going to have to grab one. There we go, team. We got ourselves a nice coconut. But today we want to be using um, a big axle, big X. If you guys don't know about that. So normally we use a grow bar or something, something sharp, whatever you need, or you can even use your teeth. But I'm not going to do that, I'm not going to Anyways, stuck that baby in. We'll wait for Lucy. Like so. Just like that, okay? Push and pull. Me and Lucy. Lucy. That's what we're going to need. First thing, we're going to grab it in. One. Two. And there you go. Beauty. Just like that. Yeah. 
as you can see, it's all done. And normally when you do it for the ladies, we still eat it. This is the mouth. These are the eyes of this um, of the eel. If you can see it closely, you can see it's kind of like got the sad eyes because uh, it's, its head got chopped off as it was growing up. But um, this is the mouth. So the girls, the female in the islands, they drink from the mouth of the coconut or the eel itself. But because we want to do it for the lads, we're going to chop it up at the back. We'll turn it upside down, like <coughs> so. Okay, we don't have anything. Yes, darling. But we're going to do it the island way. We're just going to find what works better, All right? Just like that. And then, beauty. Why are you laughing? And that's how you drink a coconut, like a guy, but the ladies obviously from the mouth. But yeah, that was a bit too much, but we still got the job done, right? I'm just going to have another sip and then I'm going to share it around. Do I'm drinking, mate, from the coconut itself. You want to hear some? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Looks it's like a nice from Joe. She's still uh, blending in. Oh, oh, you want to? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's alright. Maybe. Have you wanna have some? Yes. Yeah. Drink. Yummy? Oh yeah. Oh, that's right. It's pretty good, eh? Mm, yummy, Mom. Mommy, yummy. Oh yeah. That's all from me today. Thanks for coming through. Stay tuned. We'll go see what others up to. <laughs> This is the menu. I don't know if you guys can see that. You can just pause the video. It's the prices for everything. On this side. The drinks. It's coming back up. Chilling, about to go swimming. Mom, any last words? Wait, last word now. Holy God! I mean, holy God! I mean, 
Mom's still not gonna fight everyone this trip, guys. By the way, <laughs> we forget that Lani's a big star, and you know people keep stopping him, man. Mm. Uh, it gets a, this for the fans out there. Just beware of the partners of the famous people. They're real yeah, people too. They matter too. Yeah, they matter. Their lives matter as well. <laughs> yeah. well Ask them for further next time. What would, what would Ask they... me. What would they... <laughs> <laughs> what would they... <laughs> what would they... <laughs> What was the, <laughs> what was the <laughs> highlight <laughs> of your trip? Oh, yeah. Engagement. Oh, nice. That was nice, eh? It was. How was dinner tonight? Dinner was good. Oh, How was your like food, Law? Five out of ten. <laughs> Five? Five? Oh, yeah. oh, wow. Hey, hey. Yeah, Harley. Yeah, oh, oh, this is oh, quite oh, sponsored. He's on the door. I five out of ten. I found a made a pool of Salitonga. Five out of ten. Salitonga, do better. Salitonga, man. Your chicken is like two rubber. Or, uh, yeah, the, <laughs> the, <laughs> the chicken was very pissed out to me. Chicken pissed out? Some real sad, right? I saw some straight on me. Yeah, sad. Yeah, next time just call it a seafood plates. Mm -hmm. A platter implies it's Blair. large. Large dinner plates. You share it. You couldn't even share it. Right. Sharing. Wow, we are never going to be invited back. <laughs> <laughs> Not that they invited us in the first place. <laughs> no, but it's great. It's beautiful. Yeah. The, the scenery and the swimming pool and everything. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10, out of 10. 10 out of 10. The vibes are there. Yeah. Mm. It's just there. It's just the price of the office is now at the table. Oh, God. They have this weird system where you like... You can't pay cash, you have to like put it to a room. Yeah, it works nice for hotels and uh, double rooms. And, and but for villas where, where people. Yeah, yeah. Like if a whole family yeah. was in a room, then that makes sense. If all friends, friends are all different. Wow. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, so Lon leaves tonight, tomorrow morning at 2. That's when the transfer um, car leaves the resort. Very sad. Sad reality. Yeah. Tears. You can see the sadness in there. Sorrows. And more sadness Sorrows. in there. Sorrows. 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 Two days. Two days. Two on Sunday. Yeah. 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 Yeah.